Last week, the Namibian police banned public demonstrations scheduled for this week due to security reasons. However, the Namibia Transport and Taxi Union had already submitted the request with the police in May. That's why me as a leader, I cannot go from here while my people are still here. If it is a killing, I am included. I must die with my people. I cannot let my people be beaten or die. No. So all I want is the police to escort our people to Dongeruk so that we can go with the free heart, with peace, to the Ministry of Works and Transport. That's all that we want. The demonstration started in Evelyn Street, where close to 600 taxi drivers met with the union representatives. Others were sent to the Ministry of Works and Transport to get feedback on their request for better operating conditions. A large group has gathered here at Donkerhook to await the others that have gone to the Ministry. We want our issues to be resolved soon as possible. Our brothers, those are locked up in prison because of the fines. We want this problem to be solved so that they can be released and go back to their families and do the business of maintaining their families. Many taxi drivers that drove past the demonstrators were pulled out of their vehicles and the passengers as well. If the answer that they get from the Minister of Works and Transport is not satisfactory, they promise to declare a strike whereby no taxi driver will be allowed to operate. Reporting for the News on One, I'm Joseph Shifenel.